Hey beautiful people, welcome or welcome back to the channel. I'm Josie with Awakened Soul. If you're new here, we are here to get a message from your specific person. I felt really called for this pop-up reading um, to, to basically make it just a love letter from your specific person. So um, I started off by pulling out a few cards from the Lover's Oracle, then I'll hop into some tarot and some other Oracle cards, and then pretty much I'm just going to mainly focus on message cards from them afterwards. So this is, again, like a love letter from your SP. Uh, absolutely beautiful so far with what's coming out here. Now, I have to be careful with the imagery on some of these cards, so that's the reason a couple of them are flipped upright and the others aren't. But I want you guys to notice right here, just look at the, the three cards I'm able to show you, just the way that they're embracing each other. There's just such a warm, sweet, and gentle embrace between your person and you in these imageries, essentially. So I really get the sensation that your person wants to have a physical connection with you, especially if you guys haven't seen each other in a while. They're really, really longing for your physical embrace. Okay, now um, uh, the first message we have from them to you says, give thanks for the blessings of love soon to come your way. Know that you deserve to be and have all your heart truly desires. Okay, like a wish fulfillment is coming in in the near future from this person or involving this person more than likely. Close your eyes and tell yourself that you deserve to feel joyful. You can allow joy into your life regardless of the circumstances you currently find yourself in. Beautiful. Um, also, the song Close Your Eyes by Parmalee. I love that song. That is one of my number one favorite songs of all time. But maybe give that song a listen. Close Your Eyes by Parmalee. Okay. Embrace. <laughs> no shocker. Okay. Through each other, you find the missing pieces. Oh, I'm trying to not argue with what that card says right there because you should always feel whole within yourself. Never feel like another person is going to be sent in to magically complete you. You are already whole within yourself, my dear. Okay, however, lovers, friends, and family members, and even pets can certainly complement our lives and add more joy to our lives. They don't complete us. But um, anyway, there's a little bit of romanticism there that I will allow because it's also quite cute. So, and that's how your person's feeling about you right now. Again, this is a love letter from your person to you. What's going on with them? We also have friendship. Nurture the bonds of friendship within your relationship and your love life will dramatically improve. Beautiful. Of course, you got to be friends with each other first. There has to be that foundation of friendship and like mutual respect built before any type of romantic relationship can truly flourish, right? We also have playfulness. Laughter is the best therapy. Have some fun together and remember, love is the greatest healer. Okay, so clearly a person wants to have some fun with you. They want to lighten things up a little bit if it's been overly serious lately. Um, and they want to connect as friends first, first and foremost. They want to, like, enjoy your friendship with one another, okay? Got the Six of Swords. They're thinking of travel, potentially, inviting you on some type of a trip, okay? What's all, what else is going on with their person? This is a love letter from their specific person so they want to have a publicly recognized relationship with you okay they're whole they're also hoping to be victorious hold on you guys a couple of cards went under my desk and none of them were upright so i'm not taking them but <coughs> not only do they want a publicly recognized relationship with you um but they might also want to take you to like a public space maybe even like have a public and spontaneous wedding oh my goodness you guys because two of cups too and the four of wands which is like an 11 11 card yeah this person might propose to you soon this person might be thinking about proposing like a public proposal sorry if that's not what you want to hear i'm totally on board with you there like i would probably hate a public proposal but that seems to be what your person might be thinking right now um or they, they're just fantasizing with it too uh, maybe they're they're fantasizing about you proposing to them as well. Take it how it resonates, of course. 
Um, but this person wants a publicly recognized relationship with you, okay? They don't want this to be like some type of a sneaky connection of any kind, if, maybe even if it has been in the past. They want this to be like a grounded in the 3D publicly recognized union between the two of you. Um, they have just a lot of deep love and respect and they told they fully intend on being victorious with you. So I don't know. They 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 <laughs> They're, they're not necessarily taking no for an answer, you know, unless, of course, you were to set a boundary and say you, you're not ready for that yet. But I'm just saying in general, your person is determined. That's the energy coming through is they're determined to be with you. OK, let's get some <coughs> let's get some more information out. Any additional info you guys can tell me about their specific person, collectives, specific person, any other messages? Oh, yeah, they're, like, way determined. Holy cow, you guys, yeah. Mm -hmm. Look at all this wands energy, by the way. We have wands, 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 wands. So much wands energy. So you or your person could certainly be a fire sign, or they're just, like, super fired up over you and ready to take action. Because wands energy, to me, is all about forward movement, action, boldness, authenticity, creativity, <laughs> Um, initiation, essentially, just like, I don't know, you guys, I'm just getting a lot of like, like your person's determined to be with you and they're not letting anything get in the way of that. Okay. Um, they also feel like you guys are learning a lot of really important lessons through one another and they likely want to have a family of some kind with you, even if it's just the two of you, however that looks for your situation and your life. Um, but for some of you guys out there, the person, your person wants to take the traditional route with you and actually have like a traditional set up where you guys get married and have a family and kids together and stuff like that. For some of you guys out there, your person does want like the traditional family structure, whatever that is, even though love itself is not traditional or bound by any type of rules. But I'm just saying like we have the 10 of cups here, which can indicate that the four of wands can indicate marriage. Two of cups is all about union. Um, I would expect communication from this person directly soon, like the, for them to straight up tell you all of this. Okay. Uh, for some of you guys out there, a public proposal is on its way to you as well. But yeah, let's get some, I'm going to keep this rather short because this is a short and sweet type of deal that we have going on here today. So let's get some um, messages from them. Yeah, this, what did I say, you guys? This person's taking action towards you. They're getting ready to take action. They're not, they're, they're not sitting by and letting this pass them by, you guys. Like they want to take action for sure, okay? <coughs> I don't know what else to say. I don't know how. I feel like I'm stumbling on my words for some reason. Your person is like really excitable right now. Okay. They run through my mind constantly. Yeah, that's no shocker. I'm going to text you soon. Yeah, this person is definitely going to communicate with you soon. That's like further illustrated with the eight of wands there. Like they're definitely getting ready to talk to you. If you guys are in no communication, they want to talk to you. Okay. Maybe in the past they've let old relationship wounds influence your connection and they are acknowledging that formally now. Maybe that's one of the lessons that they needed to learn through you. Okay. Or like through this connection, you guys were meant to learn that through one another. I don't want to hurt you. Yeah. I do think that they're very sensitive to the way that you feel. They don't want to hurt you. They genuinely don't. And they don't want you to hurt them either. They just want love. Like, your person's got little, like, lovey-dovey eyes towards you right now. Like, they all they want is love. All right, what else? What else? What else? What else? What would this person say? <laughs> what did I say, you guys? What did I say? What did I say? Yes, I want to marry you. I know what I'm talking about, you guys. I know what I'm talking about. Hold on, I got a cough for a second. I'm sorry. <coughs> Whew. All right, this is going to be a real brief reading, you guys. I'm not feeling called to pull much else. The message was clear. This is meant to be just a little mini love letter from your person. They love you. They adore you. They want to be with you. They want to be in union with you. They see forever with you, okay? 
uh, the, the message is very clear, and I'm an honest reader. If you don't believe me, check out some of my other readings on my pop-up reading playlist, because not all of them are like this at all. Not at all. Not at all. Not even close. Yeah, we got close or close. Again, yeah, some of you guys need to listen to the song Close Your Eyes by Parmalee. Do it. Go listen to that song Close Your Eyes by Parmalee. Take My Name by Parmalee. Just go listen to some Parmalee songs. Go make yourself a little Parmalee playlist. I love Parmalee so much, I'm not even going to lie. Um, okay, anyway. Uh, all right, we also have the name Ted coming out. Um, Ted, do 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 wed. Yeah, this person definitely wants to marry you. We have wed um, or led. I don't know what else. I'm not seeing anything else, you guys. I mean, no. Seed? Yeah, they want to plant the seed. Um, this is going to keep growing, essentially. TLC, Tender Loving Care. Vet, maybe one of you guys are a veteran or like a veterinarian, potentially. Um... Yeah, that's all I'm seeing for right now. I'm not going to get too hung up on that. I don't know why I'm getting all hung up on that right now. Uh, what I'm going to do is pull some char charms for you guys. No, just a few charms. Yeah, some of you guys are fantasizing hardcore. We got the head in the clouds type of charm. Yeah, some of you guys are fantasizing about, you guys are fantasizing about each other. We have another C coming out here and an F. Another C and another F. Yeah, some of you guys are fantasizing. What did I say, you guys? What have I been saying? I'm going to text you soon. I'm going to call you soon. And we have the little heart text message bubble messenger thing coming out here. This person is about to hit you up, okay? They're about to contact you. Just tell me when it happens. Come back and comment when it happens. And by the way, while we're on that subject, if you haven't already... Please don't forget to like and subscribe. It's the easiest way you can help my growing channel out. It's free, and it really does help me out more than you know with the YouTube algorithm. So drop a comment, can leave me a like and a, a subscribe right on. I'd super appreciate that. You're the best, okay? Um, something like some type of cycle is coming to an end between the two of you soon, okay? Um, also, just again, yeah, lots of change, lots of transformation is coming, okay? Entering into union, potentially. That might be one of the cycles that's shifting as you guys are coming into a physical 3D union with each other, okay? There's one more thing that needs to be unlocked first, and it's possibly going to happen during Pisces season if you're watching this shortly after it was released. Otherwise, that could just be a note um, that you or your person could be Pisces. Speaking of which, we have Sagittarius here with the King of Wands. Um... Do, 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 do. That's all I'm getting from that. Let me actually pull a couple of astro dice because let's get some more zodiacs out for you guys besides just Sag. Okay. Whoa. Aries. Scorpio. Aquarius. And Leo. Fabulous. Fabulous, you guys. Um, let's get a message out from the universe just for you now. Get one of my mindfulness messages out, and then I'm going to swap some of these decks out soon, so this might be the last time we get pulls from this for a little while. I like to rotate my decks every once in a while, and this one's about had its turn. All right. You guys got coming my way. Yeah. Unique opportunities aligned with my desires present themselves to me. I attract all I need to make my dreams a reality edge of greatness um oh yeah listen to the song edge of glory by lady gaga edge of greatness the universe is opening doors for me bringing opportunities my way i don't crumble at the edge of my greatness i take the opportunities that come and walk through the doors with confidence right on i'm all for it um if you guys like the video again hit like and subscribe stick around you guys are all shining stars, and I hope you know that, and I hope to see a fair future video. Bye for now.